I'm John Hugo, the um, owner and proprietor of Hugo Wines here on the eastern side of McLaren Vale. This property um, has been in my family for four generations and having all those, the, the generations of ownership behind us has made this, this property even more special to us because we can, we can look out there now and, and know that you know, there is that contact with the land. It's a, quite an amazing thing. I was born uh, here and grew up on the property. That was 1951, so I'm now I'm part of the part of the furniture, really. The history of Hugo Wines is very important because the vineyard is actually um, virtually part of the family because they're to us they're almost like our children. Um, we've hand reared them, had brought them up from. Um, you know, all those years ago and we planted them, so they're like, um, we, we know almost every vine personally. My father um, originally planted vines here, and so I started working with him on the vineyard. And we knew that we had really high quality fruit because we were selling it to other wineries who were producing extremely good wines, gold medal wines, and um, so we found the opportunity then when we weren't getting uh, much of our grapes, we decided it was time to then start making our own wine. Some of the special memories from the early days of Hugo Wines was when uh, I used to um, take our grapes down to Wayne Thomas's winery, which he had Fern Hill Estate on Ingleby Road. Uh, he used to wheel out his uh, crusher, which was affectionately known as the wheelbarrow crusher, and I would then get in the bin and fork out the grapes into the crusher. Those memories were something very special. It, it took, um, I think, the involvement and the fun to to appreciate what, what goes into making good wine. Hugo Wines has all its uh, vineyards in this one location. It makes it that very special thing that we have total control over that fruit. And now for, for the next generation to be, um, to be taking the next step and, um, and really showing our wines to the public and, and making aware of what, what we're doing here.